Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. I've got my coffee with you guys. I just got my fancy bracelets in from Tibet. They're Tibetan to ward off evil energies, guys. So I've been waiting for these for a long time. So I love them. It's beautiful, beautiful artwork on these stones. They're real stone, guys. So thank you so much for being here, guys. I can ward off all, all the evil energies I can get. So guys, I felt led to say a prayer for you guys today. So I did. I prayed for your protection, your families, your homes, peace, love, growth, light, calm. Let's find out what's going on for the collective. Archangels, spirit guides of the highest white light. What is it that you would like the collective to know? And I'm going to say right now that I've got somebody out there that's emailing me like 30, 50 times, 20, 10. I don't care how many. I'm not going to put up with your obnoxiousness on my channel. So if you don't like the messages, you need to go away. You cannot harass me. Okay, by sending me email after email when you hear something that you don't like. Now, guys, you got to not. The, this is one person I am referring to. You need to stop emailing me. Okay, because I'm getting fed up with your emails. You're interfering. You're using up all my usage, guys. I don't read your messages, just so you know. This one particular person, I don't acknowledge you. I do not respond to you. Stop emailing me. God, guys, this is repetitive daily, over and over again. You need to stop emailing me. And I'm not going to mention any names, but... You're getting very vulgar, and you are getting very obnoxious, and I'm getting very tired of you filling up my mailbox with crap, garbage, that I don't read, that I do not acknowledge, and I will not acknowledge. So stop emailing me. And I'm talking to one person in particular. Stop doing it. Let's talk about the collective energy. You know, these are comments that are being made, guys, criticizing God, criticizing the universe. There is no God. There is no, these are evil people. God is not real, blah, blah, blah. Tell somebody who wants to hear it. I don't want to hear it, okay? You need to go to another channel. Don't come on my channel. Do not email me because if you do, I'm going to start monitoring your emails and it is harassment what you're doing. Please stop doing it. Okay? You're not important to me. I don't want to hear it. Your belief system is your belief system. Mine is mine. Don't listen to my messages. Go elsewhere. You're not welcome here. Okay? You're not welcome to email me 10 or 20 times a day. Being rude and obnoxious. Talking about um, things that... These are not even your messages, by the way. They're not directed at you. They're not for you. Okay? Trust me. I'm talking about high vibrational energies, and you are definitely not a high vibrational energy. You're not taking my energy down. So please, any more emails from you, I will consider it harassment. Know that. The rest of you, I thank. Let's go. What are the messages? Yeah. Yeah. 
seeing through someone's facade. Their secrets are lifted, insights, wise, aware, observant. Spirit knows what's going on, okay? So, yeah, this is messages, communications, faxes, emails. You know what gets me? Why do people spend the time and the energy doing this, communicating? I'm not interested, okay? Like, seriously. So, these are... You know, the rest of the community here is focusing in on their finances, their prosperity, their money, their income, their commerce, getting large quantities of things, okay? And no more set. This is the Wheel of Fortune. Hmm. No. We come in the energy of love and peace and harmony or do not communicate at all. Period. If you have nothing good to say, keep it to yourself. Period. Hmm. Yeah, this is someone who is hardworking, intelligent, conscientious, helpful, okay? Hmm. Okay, enough being said. I'm not entertaining that energy. Guys, focus in on your finances, your success. Don't let other people discourage you or keep you off track. That is what the message is. Do not allow other people's negativity to keep you down. It is a fact of life that we live in that we deal with negative energy on a daily basis. Okay? It does not affect my energy, guys. I focus in on the things that are good. I focus on the things that are of good. Yes, do we have things that are going on around us? We'd be foolish to think that it didn't. It does. It exists. It's real. Just don't email me with it. Okay? And I'm not talking to all of you guys. I'm focused in, and the collective energy is focused in on growth. Financial growth, emotional growth, and spiritual growth. If you're not into any kind of stuff like that, you're watching the wrong channel. Just for real. Have confidence during this time of great joy, renewal, and connection to spirit. Your angels are guiding and protecting you on your spiritual journey. There are two paths ahead for you in love. So be true to yourself. Because a wish is being granted. Your heart's desire. Now, every ending has a new beginning. This is the chariot. Charge ahead with confidence, stay strong, and focused. Because you will be celebrating. Let's go.
And these messages are not personal, guys, to any one of you. These are general. Take the messages that are for you and do not entertain the rest. I do not dictate what comes out in the reads, just so you know that. And it is unfortunate that if I keep getting these messages, I will withdraw my email altogether. I have a job to do, and that's what I'm doing. I don't dictate the reads or the information. If you don't believe in angels, and you don't believe in spirit, and you don't believe in those things, then don't come against me because I do, or the collective energy does. These reads are not intended for you. Plain and simple. Balance. Everything in balance. Stay strong, determined. Yeah, somebody is tricking someone by communicating, okay? This is, people may be contacting you, collective energy. It's a trickster, okay? They're trying to get you off focus, trying to somehow weaken you, somehow. These are just trickster energies. Don't entertain them. That's the devil. And you're too wise. And you are divinely protected. You have the victory, and guess what? Those are for those who do believe, not for those who don't. Collaborate. You've got your freedom. So be still and grow. You have the power. You have the victory. And not everybody's liking that, guys, just to be real. Hmm. And they are going to be revealed. Mm hmm Yep. And they're afraid. Yes, they are. It's to keep you all focused, guys. So you might be getting in communications, texts, emails, stuff like that, because... You know, before every victory, before every success, you always get this in nuisance energies. And really, that's all they are. Nuisances. Just go with the flow. And release these energies. Enjoy your life. Enjoy your peace, your harmony, your happiness. Yeah, everything is illuminated. Live a simple life. Mm, you could be seeing feathers. Hmm. You're getting being congratulated for a wonderful job. It's time to move on to the next project. Promotions, awards, being recognized. That's the wheel. That is your destiny. That is your fortune. And it is everybody's God's given right, every personal right. I don't care if you believe who you believe in. Everyone has the right to peace and happiness and prosperity. And for those who don't believe that, that's on you. Don't email me. Perspective. You've got two paths to choose from. You're being protected. Okay? There is so much to accomplish. Make a very detailed plan. You're being watched over by someone very, very kind. 
Believe in yourself, listen to your heart, and do what you enjoy. This is an empress here. Act upon your plans. Creativity is being rewarded. Luxurious or abundant resources being made available to you. Stand up for what you believe in. Claim your own personal power. The star. A dream come true. Believe in yourself. The end of the difficult situation. This is so much to be grateful for. Financial success and the promise of retirement. A rich and rewarding family life is going on. And because you're being blessed, and because you're getting all this good fortune, and because you're getting a victory, and because you're being protected, and because you're being watched over, usually the enemy does not like that. It's their own fear. Judgment. You are stable, you are grounded, and you've got an avenging angel. And because of this, somebody, people, some people get angry because you've got the victory here. Because you're celebrating. They're angry because whatever. I don't care why they're angry. You're confident. Remain focused. There's blindness. You know, this could be don't want to see you get this abundance these blessings guys huh. it's their own emotional wounds you're being divinely protected that is the truth you're being watched over you're going to make your angels are making sure that your blessings are protected that you are protected. And like I said, that makes other people very hurt to see you celebrate. That is your good fortune. That is your victory. That is your good karma for the good works that you have done. And not everybody likes it. Higher authority. Now they got to face their own judgment, their own fears, their own burdens. Look, there's love here. The universe is offering you a big cup of emotional fulfillment, of promising you these are gifts from the universe. And Spirit is going to protect those who have done the work. And that's the way it is. So trickster energies, we do not trust you, and that is just the way it is. They can rant and rave and say whatever they want, but you have the authority. This is your dominion, your right to have peace, harmony, and to be protected, and to protect your blessings and your abundance, period. And this makes people hurt. They're confused, okay, about your growth. They can mourn and they can drink from that cup. But the collective energy is going to be drinking from the cup of the Most High, okay? These are God-given rights that each and every one of us have. It is our God-given right to be happy, to have joy, to have growth, have abundance, have good news. Yes. And because you have walked away, you could be collaborating. Yeah, see? That's on them. That's the choice they made. That's on them. You have chosen to have 
you're being divinely protected, okay? This is a star seed. This is someone who is successful, someone who is a healer, someone who is, this is divine intervention. You are being divinely guided and protected, and that is it. And they are stuck. And they can be envious and feel defeated, but truth is truth, okay? And someone who wants to... This is a new cycle. What's this all about? Justice. A victory. In silence, you have your intuition and your instincts. And this is your abundance. Mm. Mm. That's the way it is. That's why they spy on you. Pretty simple that, you know, it's all about choices and the consequences of them. The collective energy is not responsible for that. And people get right angry. You know, people get angry at God. People get angry at the angels. Why? thinking, I don't care why, that's on them. I'm not a nobody's, I'm not baby and nobody, guys. It's not happening. Not entertaining it. Now, look, the message is, I had a dream last night, it was told loud and clear by my spirit guides. It, these people are just making attacks upon you to keep you from focusing in on your blessings. That's it. That's on them. Take care, everyone. I love each and every one of you guys. You've been a blessing here. And I can tell you that you're being blessed. And that's just the bottom line. And don't let others take you off your path and let others, you know, bring you down and try to bring confusion and doubt. That's all they're there for. Keep focused on your blessings. Keep focused on your abundance, your happiness. Focus on, on the good things. And like I said, you're going to get a, a tax, but nothing you can't handle. It's just brush it off. It means nothing. Honestly. It means nothing. Nothing that your spirit guides can handle. Nothing you can handle. It's a simple life. Enjoying the simplicity of life after this. Take care.